Hello everyone! So this is a random vlog because today I need to fill in the gap in my wall and the reason why there is a gap in the wall is because this is normally where my um, hook is which I use to tie a ribbon for my curtains so the other day I had one coat hanging there and I wore another coat out so I put the same, uh, not the same, a different coat on the hanger and there were two coats and after a few hours, it wasn't even a full day, just a few hours, the hook decided to give way and I must commend 3M for their, you know, like stickiness of the hook because not only did the hook just drop off, it pulled my wall out. So now I gotta fix the wall. So, you know, very stressed. But I wanna fix my wall because I do not like this very ugly mark of regret for hanging two coats together. So, yes. This is a video about me fixing my wall. So these are the three products I just bought. This is the plaster for filling the wall. This is the spoon thingy. My dad said it's not spoon, but I call it the spoon thingy to smooth it. And this here is the sandpaper to sand it. I just want to say right now, I'm trying to cut the nozzle off and I'm already struggling. Like This is not going well for me. I am just no, I can't. Ah. Okay, so I finally managed to do it with a saw blade. I'm going to try very hard to not mess this up, even though yeah, it is very hard. Not as good. I did like a second coat because the first one wasn't that great. So um, hopefully if I sand it later, it'll be like perfect and stuff. And then tomorrow I can paint it. So I guess I'm like almost done now, but I still need to sort of sand it down. And honestly, trying to plaster it was one of the hardest things I've ever done because I think I kept messing up. Like it wasn't fully dry, but then because it's like quick dry or something, so it dries quite quickly and I was trying to smooth it out and then it would like pull in the wrong direction and it was just quite tough trying to get it level even though it's only like two millimeters or like even less but yeah I hope I never have to do this again and it's funny because all the YouTube tutorials they're for like holes that are like really huge as if like someone punched the wall and they make it look so easy and I was just doing like a tiny gap and it was like ah, help so yeah so it seems to have finally dried and it actually looks smooth now Woo! hi so I have my sandpaper and the only thing that can go wrong now is if I sandpaper this wrongly because it's actually dried really nice and smooth well not really that smooth because I got a sandpaper that dried yeah, so I, I hope I don't mess this up. Oh my god, it's smooth! Okay, it kind of like sticks out a bit, but it's... Yeah! 
Oh, it seems smooth now. So. What do I do with this? How do I know if it's gonna be anything? Do I wash thin paper? Can you do that? So I guess I am not a failure because I kind of managed to smooth it and stuff and now I just need to buy paint. Yay! Part one done! Hello everyone! So welcome to Jack Tries to Fix a Wall Part 2! So I'm basically going to paint the mark up there which I don't think it's very visible now but yeah and hopefully I don't mess this up like the first one the first time. Okay, so I realized that I don't actually know how to open it because it is a weird seal, so I had to YouTube how to open a paint can. Actually, I'm very stressed again because it says on the can, right, that you're supposed to put one coat and then wait two hours and then put a second coat, which feels like ridiculously long to me. Hello! I'm back after two hours because I had to wait for it to dry. I realized you can't even really see it on the wall because it kind of blended in already but I should put two coats so this is my last coat and then I'm done from doing this stupid thing that I never wanted to do nice. Hello. so I forgot to film a closing video the other day when I finished but Basically, it is back to being a perfect white wall. It can, you can kind of feel that there's like a bump and it comes out a bit, but you can't see it, which is all that matters. So, I did good. And if I can do this, you can do it too.